Oh, oh my gosh, what a take. What a take, man. That was awesome. people let's go catch some fish if you're gonna follow me the tri fisher you need to know one thing about me i love pals okay it's a very delicious fast food chain here in east tennessee and i mean east tennessee check it out We've got hamburgers We've got giant hamburger hot dog sweet tea are you kidding me right now Hi, um, can I get a peachy tea, please? Peachy tea? No way. All right, thank you. Thank you. I'm such a big fan of Pals that I secretly want to be sponsored by them. I'm basically a giant internet influencer, so I've got like 42 subscribers. Um, all I need is free peachy tea for the rest of my life, and I'm in. So, if you guys know anybody in the upper chain of command, like Al, himself go ahead and just put in the word that the tri fisher he likes him some pgt okay yeah. farewell pals till next time but seriously if you could sponsor me that'd be great okay people here's the game plan for today i'm going to be fishing the holston river in kingsport the area i am fishing is heavily fished the fishing pressure is extreme. Um, they've been basically hammered from April till now, which is in August. So that means they've seen every type of crankbait, jig, rubber worm, you name it, they've seen it, they're not biting it. However, all smallmouth have one weakness, the live shiner, which is why I'm now at Melboro's Tackle Box to acquire two dozen lively shiners i'll be back all righty here they are just a bunch of shiners ready to go okay people i'm at my location the deal is pretty simple today we've got 15 pound leader about three feet up we're gonna have a bobber and then live bait holston river is right here Check it out. The flow is perfect, and now it's time to drop some shiners in and see if that bobber shoots under. Check my drag, it's good. Oh, there it is. Oh, ripped it right out of his mouth. Let's try that again. Got him. All right, guys, smallmouth number one, little guy. He'll get us started. Top side of that brush. There we go. Right on the top side. Fish on. I think I got a fish on. Yep. Got him. Bass number two. Oh, and there's another one chasing. There's a bunch of there's a bunch of largemouth little ones that were just chasing this guy. Here we go. Bass number two, another little guy. But uh, we'll get him back in there. See if there's any more buddies to uh, catch as well. There were a bunch of them chasing him. None of them were super big, but I have to believe there's got to be one sizable one over here. Ooh, pulled it out of his mouth. It was in his mouth, guys. Oh, I can see him. I can see him. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, he's coming right for it. Here we go. Here we go. There it is. Got him. Oh, I had him. Oh, man, this is crazy. All right, guys. Let me grab another one. They're, they're feeding. Guys, I know these aren't huge bass right now attacking, but man, is this fun. My heart rate's high. I'm excited. I can see them. They're right down here in the shallows and they're feeding right now.
Oh, he smacked it. Did you guys see that hit? <laughs> That was so cool. Oh my gosh, I actually saw that one happen. That was awesome. Man, these little bass, they're crazy. I cannot believe that just happened. That was so cool. All right, number three, Largy. Get them back. Let's catch some more, man. They're loaded here. Holy smokes, guys. Look at that spider right there. Whoa. Guys. Okay, that dude, to put it in perspective, here's my thumb, you know? He's a big dude. Spider free zone over here. That was crazy. Just goes to show you should always be looking for spiders and things. Just never know. Time to hit up our next spot. Trying to get a decent shiner on here. We got some little ones today. <sighs> All right, guys. Um, I thought I was recording. However, I was not recording. But look at this beauty. Big smolly. That's what I'm talking about, okay? Um, so we're gonna go ahead and do a release on this guy. I uh, caught him down here, got wrapped around a tree. Had an absolutely crazy fight. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, had a bass. Took my bait. Ah, oh, dang it. All right. Let's go back and do it again. Okay, guys. I, uh, I just missed a bass right here, so we're going to go right back to it, if I don't trip. Okay, he was right on the other side of this log, and I don't think he felt the hook. He just got a free meal, so let's drop it back down, see if he'll take again. Other side of that tree there, that's a good spot. Hmm. Great spot right there. Fish on. Oh, it was cool. Oh, no. Oh, no. From fish to tree. Oh, that hurts. All right. There's only one thing to do. You got to go get another one. Keep trying. So, I've now missed two fish in this spot. It's a loaded spot. Sometimes there's just multiple fish in one spot. So, we're going to see if anyone else is interested in smacking this guy. Right in here. This is the zone. Oh, shoot. Stuck. Oh! Ow! Uh, okay. <laughs> Ow! What in the world is that? Whoa, cicada. Look at that. Oh my gosh, what a take. What a take, man. That was awesome. Little bass. Little bass right here. Actually got him hooked in a weird kind of way. Now. All right. Little largy for the win. Drop him down. That was cool. See if I can Get back in there. Aha, here's an opening. Cool. Because oh. if you guys can see this, this looks really, really, really fishy back in here. Tree, get out of the tree. This is why it's no bueno. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Oh. Uh, oh there's no, there's no shiner left. Just uh, some leaves. That's painful. Let's keep moving. Okay, people. I fished it hard. But I think I'm going to throw in the towel. So time to let my shiners go. And see if the, uh, the birds want them. The ducks. 
You guys want some shiners, eh? I think you do. Oh my, oh no. Whoa. Oh man, it's a massacre. They're just going crazy. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Oh, fast busting right there. Oh man. Well, that kicked my butt. However, had a lot of fun, caught some fish, and I still have my peachy tea. Oh, so good. I really need to get sponsored by Pals. Let's make that happen, people.